Awesome. Good to have you with us. One of the stars of the film, Melissa DeSalle, is joining you. us today. Yes. Welcome. Thank you so much. So uh, that character, so Shelby, your character, yes. uh, Fireplug, still a really <laughs> fiery troublemaker, right? Yes, I still I call her Shelby 2.0 Yeah. <laughs> in this sequel, yeah. And still, but uh, very much um, free spirit, let's say, yeah? Uh, free spirit, that's a nice word. I've I was never trying to find the nicest spirit. way to say it. Yeah. <laughs> I've never been called that, just the B word. So tell us, where were you when, when the film ended and where are you now? Okay, the last... Catch, catch everyone up. Okay, the yeah. first <laughs> film, I literally, I have been dumped by Harold Perrineau, who right. plays Julian, right. and then I end up in bed with Terrence Howard, and at the end of the first movie. The second movie, I come back, I'm single, I'm bigger and badder, I'm a reality star, and I am on fire. And you're sassy. You're throwing underwear I am at sassy. everyone's <laughs> but, but they're clean. But they're clean. That's what oh my goodness. Well, they're clean. I don't think I wouldn't throw dirty underwear. Yeah, no. I would, I would certainly hope. So, uh, so, so when we come back, everybody's moved on in their lives. Though. Everyone's it takes moved place, on. Yeah. It takes place a, a good while later. Um, yeah, 10 years. It's supposed to be, I think, 10 years. About 10 years yeah. in the future. Yeah. How has everybody changed and how are their lives different now at the beginning of this film? Well, you mean character-wise? Yeah, character-wise, not actors. Yeah, you know, I... Yeah, some people had babies married. Uh, Tay Diggs and his character, his wife, Sanaa Lathan, they're married. Um, Nia is still, Nia Long is still a businesswoman, and, um, but she has a little yummy surprise, Eddie Cibrian. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so, you know, everyone's lives have has progressed. I have progressed, but I'm now single and not really identifying myself with my relationship. But I'm still, you know, I have a little vengeance on my mind and a little, you know, little digging I'm doing. It must be fun to get together with the same group of actors. I like love 10 years them. later, and did you stay in touch all of that time? You know, I, I'm still really close with Sanaa and Regina Hall. You know, we stayed in touch, and I see the guys, you know, here and there, right. but, you know, it was like a family reunion. Like, literally, it was like the little rascals on set. Like, the director had to reel us in because we we're a bunch of screaming, noisy kids. He's like, guys, guys, we've got to get this shot. Because, like, we're, we get together, we're just like a family. Yeah. What took so long? Why, why the long gap between films? Because Best Man was a success, and you normally you'd think, boom, jump right on it and have a sequel. Yeah, you know, because now we're like in the era of sequels. I feel like that's the in thing to do these yeah, days. Everything. You know what I mean? But I think, you know, I think it was good that he waited so that we could all grow, even just as actors. And, you know, you have to be inspired to write a script. So Malcolm was doing other things and, you know, it, I think he was just inspired at this time. I think the timing's perfect. Now, let's talk about Read Between the Lines because I, I just read an article where yeah. you said the character was like a work in progress and you said, I'm always a work in progress. Yeah. So I want to know, how are you today? Have you, like, cause that was a few years ago. So. I, listen, I'm still working, Rebecca. It's still, <laughs> I, I'm I never, just love that. I love that you, you, you like to evolve. You like yeah, to grow. Yeah, I'm person. never going to stop growing. You know, I'm never, you know, you always can learn something from someone, you know, and I think that's great. As I get older, I think I get better. You know, I read books. You know, you just, you, you, new things work as you get as time moves on. Maybe this what didn't work for you before, maybe d works for you now, and maybe you know vice versa. You know what I mean? Yeah. You uh, you said that your character Shelby's a reality star. Yes. Uh, in the film, uh, what about you? Do you watch reality TV at all? We have Phaedra Parks on today. Oh, we have, oh my we have a real, we, we have a real housewife <laughs> today. So what what about you? Do you watch any reality? That is so funny. I have watched some of them. I don't watch it regularly. I, I mean, I usually probably just watch scripted television most of the mm -hmm. time. But I do watch it occasionally, occasionally. I mean, they are entertaining. It's a guilty pleasure. It There's sometimes is a guilty, sort of guilty pleasure. pleasure. And you could have said, I'm well, I'm just doing though, research. So. Yeah, you just, I'm, yeah. I'm, yeah, I'm still mourning the loss of you and um, all my children. No, seriously, I was one of those people at home just angry. Like, I don't want to watch a cooking show. I'd rather watch all my children. And you know what, it's familiar. When I the hospital, that was my lineup. It's familiar. It brings you back to your childhood, you know, it, I feel yeah, like. Yeah, I just, miss my lineup. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You're from New York City, but you live out in L.A. now. I am, born and raised. But w when you come back uh, to Queens, to your, to your old neighborhood, <laughs> oh, yeah. uh, are you a big celebrity? Are you a big star I, there? Yeah, Is it tough yes. to be back home yeah, again? Yeah, people come over and knock on my mother's door for things that just aren't necessary. It's like, they just well, want to see you. I haven't, why are you here, sir? I don't even know who you are. You know <laughs> what I mean? Oh, no. And then I have people on Instagram that just randomly who I haven't talked to, and they're putting, like, my street name, my nickname, you know what I mean? Just oh, saying little oh, things, really? you know, to show that they know me, but, you know. Well, do you miss New York? I mean, I see, I, I ran into her at an audition in L.A. We yes. saw each other yes. in an audition. Um, but uh, do you miss New York? And Oh, and gosh, I miss it. it. I, I mean, when I get here, I just immediately had to put on my little walking shoes and just start ripping and running because I, I, I miss it so much. But I come back here often because my yes. family's still in Queens. Yeah. And um, if I had it my way, I would be half the year here and half the year there. But I love it. I love the snow. I love the seasons. It's my place. It's me. 
You originally you majored in dance. I and did. You studied dance and then yeah. sort of uh, left that and went more into acting. Do you miss dancing or do you still get a chance to dance? You know, I'll take classes every now and again, but I feel like I have to get in shape to go to the dance class. Do you know what I'm saying? They're hard. They're yeah. really tough out there, too. They're really <laughs> tough. But yeah, I went to the high school performing arts here in New York City and I was a dance major and then I danced with Alvin Ailey for two years after I got out of high school. And, you know, I'd like to incorporate it somewhere in my acting career if it ever can happen. Yeah, well. What about you were dancing, dancing with the stars? You were well, yeah. Wouldn't I you know, be perfect for that? I, yeah, but I don't, I don't think they like when you're a dancer to become no, on No, they there. do. They do. They do? Like yeah, you've got a girl. I heard she was, they were giving her a little smack because... She's oh no! They like they like when you can okay, dance. They okay. do. I can't do that skating. But thing you got you to did, dance though. a little bit in this in this I, movie, didn't you? <laughs> well, that's a little kind of in your groove on. <laughs> yeah, a little like, twerking or something. It wasn't twerking. <laughs> <laughs> no, we have a no twerking no, rule yeah, here right. on the better thank show. You. Thank right, you. Right. Right. Thank you so much thank for you being so with us. Much. Thank really you so much. Really good. And check out the Best Man Holiday, which is in theaters now.